What's going on, everyone? Blender here, and I'm going to show you guys something really cool. We're going to level up our music in New World on our phone so that we can watch shows like uh, True Blood and still get some stuff done. <laughs> That's actually what uh, got me started on this. So, yeah, check it out. All right, so step one, you guys already have this done. Install Steam, install New World, duh. <laughs> and uh, that's all you gotta do on the computer side, pretty much. Step two, go on your phone and go to the App Store and download Steam Link. So just open up your App Store, uh, Google Play on the Android, type in Steam Link and download and install it. Once that's installed, go back to your home screen on the phone, open up Steam Link, so once you get Steam Link opened up, it should say something about, you know, new computer or scan for computers. Go ahead and do that. If you're going back into it like I am just to show you guys how to do it, then you're going to want to click on that gear icon in the top right, the settings. And then you're going to want to click on other computer or computer and then other computer or rescan. And what it's going to do is it's going to give you a pairing number like, you know, a Bluetooth pairing code or whatever pin number. And this is where you go to your computer, you open up Steam, and you put this number in there. I'm going to show you how to do that really quick. All right, and once you have the pairing code, that's where you go back to the computer. You go to Steam, Settings, uh, you go to Remote Play, and you go to Pair Steam Link. And you just put in the code that it gave you on your phone. Mine is 7631, so I would just click that, type in 7631, hit OK and then hit OK, and you should see your device paired up here. It's gonna be, this is a Samsung S22, so that's apparently what the uh, internal name is. And yours is gonna be, you know, whatever you have there. Now, I did kind of get this working a little bit with the iPhone, but I'm gonna play around with it a little more. I have an XR, so um, I'm sure you guys have newer ones, but we'll see if we can get that working too. Uh, you're just not gonna be able to use the same controller that I got. That's made specifically for an Android with the USB-C, so not gonna work. Um, Anyway, you hit OK, and then it's going to be paired up, and you could just minimize Steam at this point, and you're going to finish everything up on the phone. And then once you're finished with that, you're going to go back to your phone, and you should have your computer listed there. And all you do is you just click on it, and then you hit Start Playing. It's going to bring up your, I think it's called, like, it looks kind of like the big screen or whatever it's called on, you know, on your PC. But anyway, this is the interface. And for me, I just hit Resume and Explore, but you're going to want to go to the library, uh, select whatever game you want to play and you're ready to rock and roll you just hit play and it's going to get you into the game on your phone and basically it's just going to be mirroring you know what your computer's doing but you can control it with the phone so a couple things you know the computer does have to be powered on it does have to be connected to the internet and you have to be logged into steam but that's it you know you can go to work you can go uh somebody's house you could hook up to their wi-fi you can even play this in the car as long as your computer is running and you know connected to the internet at home you could do this from anywhere now there's also another option i'm going to talk about later on um, it's called you know geforce now that's really really cool so i'm going to talk about that show you guys probably how to set it up so that you can do this on geforce now also if you don't have a pc because if you don't have a pc you can actually use nvidia's hardware on the cloud it's called like cloud gaming cloud computing so you don't have to have you don't even have to have a nice phone just a device you know tablet phone uh whatever and as long as you can connect to the internet and hook up with uh, geforce now download the app on it then you're good to go and you can it's a monthly subscription and you could pay um you know per month to use you know all the way up to like the power of a 3080 so pretty crazy and it actually does work so if you guys are interested in that be on the lookout i'll do another one on how to fish or not fish how to play music on new world in new world rather on your phone all right so this is what i uh, bought it was like 70 or 80 bucks i just got it at walmart and uh it's actually really really cool and it literally comes with like one thing this is it so that's all it is this keeps these pieces together so when you're ready to play you just pop this off doesn't come off all the way, but you know, it kind of breaks apart. And you got your controller. It's uh, stretchy, you know, so you can fit it over your phone. Here's your USB C. 
and you simply just take your phone. This is a Samsung S22 and you just plug it in there. Oops, keep doing that. And that's it. And then you take the other side and you know, you stretch it over and just like that. You're ready to rock. Check it out. Boom. No lag, nothing. I mean, it runs freaking great. I mean, it's got to catch up a little bit, but yeah, runs really good for the most part. <laughs> so here it is on Amazon. I guess they do have one for the, the iPhone. Now, um, I mean, you could go down to the questions and see, you know, hey, does this work for the XR or just the X? So um, I don't, I, I guess I'll have to look into it, you know, to check it out, see if I can get it. Uh, so that one's 59 on Amazon. I actually paid 80 bucks for this thing at Walmart. So I'm going to take mine back probably tomorrow and then uh, just order one of these. 45 bucks for the Android one. That's the same exact one I have right there. So I'll put the links for both of these in the description. Um, and I do remember the one time I did have trouble with the iPhone. It was because I didn't have a controller. And there was like no way to do it without the controller. So now, uh, you know, since if, if I get this one for the iPhone, which... I might. We'll see. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it should work fine. It should work fine. So I can't wait to test that out. Probably order this tonight. But anyway, that's it, guys. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope it was helpful. And if you have any questions or run into any, any trouble, let me know. You know, get on my Discord, leave a comment. We'll figure it out. And uh, we'll get you playing music and leveling up while you're at work or at school, which is what we're supposed to be doing when we're at work or at school. Thanks for, thank you so much for watching, everybody. Um, my name's Slender. It's been a pleasure, and you guys all have a great day. Bye-bye.